Welcome back to my channel guys. It's your girl Coco Styles and on this channel we talk about beauty, fashion, and lifestyle. But in today's video, I'm going to give you guys all of the basics that you need in your closet. Now, I don't have shoes here today because I will do a separate video on that for my big foot girls. But these are basic tops and jackets and shirts that I feel that every wardrobe needs in order to have a functioning wardrobe. So let's just get started and just jump right into it. Most of the tops are from Zara, so they are affordable. And some of the other ones are from, I believe, Abercrombie and Fitch. So let's just get started. So I'm going to start right here with the infamous white top. The white button-up shirt to me can go with absolutely anything. You can pair it with jeans, you can pair it with a skirt. I've seen people pair it with biking shorts. I've seen people pair it with leggings. Um, I prefer to wear this with jeans or even a skirt and tie it up at the top. Or if it's longer as a shirt dress, then I would do that with some booties and a nice little clutch and maybe a, some sort of hat or something like that just to add a little spice to it. But this is more of a bigger feel. It's more loose fitting. I do have another one that's more slim fit. It's in the cleanest, but I would recommend having more than one. One that fits you fitted and then the other one that fits you a little bit more loose so you have a little bit more um, leeway when it comes to tying it up. So with that... I recently incorporated a black one, but the black one is more of a silky top. Um, it's not, this is, this actually feels really good. It's from Zara. Um, and it's from the, what is this? The Join Life collection. Um, I think that's what that is. I don't know. Maybe that's just a tag. I don't know. But there's two in there that they have. Um, that might just be the tag. Uh, there's two. This one, this particular one, I'm going to link it below for you guys. But this one has a really good texture to it. The other one felt a little bit stiff. I'm a little bit more cheap, but this one feels really, really good. So that's a black button-up long sleeve top and a white one. And you can get, you can actually get the black one in white also if you didn't want to get a material like cotton as your white button-up. So... Um, the next essentials that I think everyone should have are my oh, turtleneck bodysuits. And these are from Zara. I really like these. And I keep these in my wardrobe consistently. Um, I don't have to replace them every year um, because you don't. I don't wear them all the time. But these can go under blazers. These can go under cardigans. These can be worn by themselves. I will say this that all of Zara's tops mm, all of their bodysuits that have no sleeves they do cut a little long here so make sure you have on a bra that doesn't show or if you have on a jacket you're fine but I have like a taupe color here and I have a black one um I would recommend I would wear these with a blazer and probably by itself in the summertime by itself and in the fall winter maybe depending on where you live under a blazer so that's turtleneck bodysuits and guys these do have the strap at the bottom which is great um i do not buy bodysuits that do not have snaps <laughs> uh the next basics are tank tops and these are from zara also but these have more of like a i don't know more of a not they're not cotton I don't even know what material this is but it's more of like a sleek feel they're very smooth and I actually have one on now so this one is the white one I hope the color is showing up this one is like a, a taupe color and this one is a cream I like these because I wear them under everything um, and like I said these, are the, these actually fit okay on the sides. They're not too low here. And they kind of snug you in a little bit as if you had on like some sort of control top or something. But I recommend these. And they're pretty cheap. I believe these are like $12.90 um, Zara and their prices. 
And then I have some t-shirt type ones. Guys, these actually feel really good. I wish they had the long sleeve t-shirt version of these because the cotton on this, I, I love it. And it has like a pretty good stretch to it. I am six feet tall and probably 195 maybe. Um, I got these in the large because they are kind of fitted around the bust area. Um, if you want them bigger, I recommend going up. However, I like the way they fit because they slide right into your pants or even to a skirt and it gives you like a sleek feel. So I just got black and white. I wish they had more colors guys, but they didn't. So I just got black and white. So in the next essentials that I think your closet needs, and these are just tops so far guys. Um, these are tops that I think would make your outfit go easy. Like if you're just going out to run out to the store, you can just throw, and if you wanna look decent, you can just throw on a turtleneck one, a blazer, and some jeans, some flats or something, or maybe some pumps, and you're good to go. And the next set of bodysuits I have, and all of these guys have the snap. Um, if you guys notice, I'm getting all neutral colors because I think these are essential for your wardrobe. Um, you can always buy more than one white one because they always tend to get, I don't know, they always tend to need to get a little dirty and don't come out. I don't know. It could just be me. Um, what well, could be like the deodorant maybe? I don't know. But <laughs> I got a white one. I got a, this is not a taupe color. This is more of a pinkish nude. And I got a black one. Okay. And these again, guys, they do come down low here on the side. So I would recommend wearing I don't even know if they, they do have bras that come that or oh, no bra. If you if you can do no bra, then you do no bra. <laughs> I can't do no bra. Or um, wear it with a blazer. And these are also from Zara. And these were $19.90. Which is weird. Let me see how much these were. How much are these? Oh, yeah. These are the same price. These are a little bit cheaper. And last for tops. I just purchased these and oh my God, guys. So I've never shopped at Abercrombie and Fitch, but I so happened to go there with one of my friends the other day and they had 40% off. So we went to the back table and saw these mock neck bodysuits. Oh my God. So let me tell you, I was looking for these for forever and I wish that Zara would have had them, but I'm actually glad that they did it because the quality of these are amazing and I asked the lady do they get these off then she said no they were pretty new so I figured how about I get all colors so I have a fourth one coming that they didn't have in stock so I have a black one these also do have the snaps at the bottom and I got these in a size medium these are really snug and I got a black one a white one and I got this pretty chocolate brown color and the other color i got was like a, a beige color well yeah beige not more of a a dark tan a dark tan but um these are amazing guys and these were like i said they were on sale but the original price of these were 45 a piece um they were 40 percent off then it was like an additional 20 percent off from something else so I got a good deal on these so I would recommend picking these up because these you can just wear with some jeans a skirt uh, cardigan and have a sleek outfit and be good to go so the next essentials I think so those are just tops that I feel like you need to go under blazers and they can be worn by themselves or you can wear them with a cardigan um, well, for, with the exception of the two shirts here uh, the next thing is I would say the infamous black blazer and the nude color caramel blazer. Now, I, sorry, this is my leather jacket. This is it here. So I am a leather lover, which I need to probably get away from that. But I prefer leather blazers because more of a jacket feel. But maybe I'll venture into the other ones. So I got these two blazers here. And these fit really, really well for my height. I am six feet. Again, I'm going to keep saying it because I know a lot of us tall women do have issues with finding stuff that actually fit us the proper way. So 
I got like a caramel color and I got a black one. Um, this caramel one, this feels like, like butter soft. I got this from Blank, Blank NYC, both of them. And I believe they were like, they were pretty cheap. Probably like, I don't even want to say $200, maybe two maybe two but these are fairly old but i'll see if i can find something in link for you guys below something similar but i recommend having these because again you can wear any of these tops under it i would recommend one of the ones with the turtleneck right now it's a little chilly where i am and some cute jeans a clutch bag and some pumps or even some sling bags because it's not really cold where i am just yet so these are essentials i think um you should have in your wardrobe um I also think the infamous leather jacket. This is a must. For those of you who are, who switch up your style all quite often, a leather jacket is really, really good to have. Uh, a moto jacket, per, um, in my opinion, I think that it can go with, it can spice up any outfit. I've worn this with like a tule skirt and a t-shirt and sneakers. <laughs> um, those days where I go to church and I'm like, uh, I have to go shopping after, let me bring my sneakers. So I would have a jacket in the car with some sneakers and it would, I would still look put together, but more of an edgy look. So this I would recommend always keeping in your closet. And this is Kenneth Cole. Look on Kenneth Cole because they do have pretty good leathers. The only thing I could say about this leather is that I kind of feel like it rubs off on not on my clothes but in my car like on the armrest so other than that it's really soft leather and i really like and i believe i have a blush pink one from them too which is really pretty um but that's not really a basic because it's pink <laughs> and i also think that leather leggings are a must to keep in your closet these are bcbg and the back of them are a material so they stretch pretty pretty well and I, again I am six feet tall the reason why I like these is because they have a little bit of detailing here that makes them look almost like motorcycle-ish but they actually fit me they come down and I have a little bit of scrunch at the bottom so they're not like over my ankles again I'm six feet so when I do find things, regardless of the price, I just purchase it because it's sometimes it can be a little bit difficult finding things that actually fit. So leggings, I, leather leggings, I would recommend. Um, I'm not really a regular legging person, but leather, yes. And a leather skirt. See guys, I love leather, can you tell? <laughs> um, this is one of my leather skirts. I have so many from this is faux leather this is not even vegan the other ones are vegan um and these are just simple leather skirts you can wear these with pretty much anything you can wear it with any of these tops here you can throw a jacket over it you can wear it with the sleek one with the long sleeve in your front you can even wear it with uh, any of these these long sleeves tops you can tie them up in the front all that but i always recommend having a leather skirt in your closet regardless of the color you can do black you can do nude you can do red I have a beautiful red one um and you can do brown or green um maybe I'll do a video on all of my skirts and style all of my skirts um I think that'd be a good one because like I said I'm tall so for us when I do find things I just I rack up <laughs> I rack up um and Last but not least, some jeans, okay? I, I would recommend having three staple jeans. Now, I usually wear skinny jeans, but in this case, I ended up purchasing some, and I actually like the way they fit, some bootleg cut pants. And it's more of like a mature look when I wear them, but I would recommend having black, a dark denim, and a light denim. Um, I also would recommend like mom jeans or dad jeans. I have not found any that would fit me properly. If any other tall women are out there, please link it below for me because I've been dying for a pair, but I don't, I don't think they fit me like they should. But if you know a brand, let me know and I will definitely take, take a look at them. But these are long and they fit me really good at the, you know, down past my ankle. And these are Levi. 
and I didn't even know Levi actually sold long pants but I lucked up they have skinny jeans they have super skinny which are a little bit too skinny at the ankle for me for my liking but they do have tall and I recommend trying them if you have a hard time finding jeans but that's all guys that I have for you guys today but if you like videos like this guys please comment below um you also comment anything that you would like for me to do like I said I'm probably gonna do a shoe video and all of the essential shoes that you should have in your closet um, for winter and for spring and summer and I'll probably do a skirt haul but if you do like fashion videos like this please comment below let me know what you like to see make sure you hit that subscribe button also hit that like and also hit that bell notification so when I do upload new videos but if you stay to the end of this video please comment Coco we see you and I will see you guys in the next one bye